So he's using a rope right now to tie off the top part. He cut the first like two or three feet of that off and now they're gonna tie it to this truck and literally pull the dog off. Wow. Is it solid? Uh, no, it's a small hole. It's not bad, but I think I could, oh man, that'd be a fun project piece. Honestly, it's so sad to see a tree of this size go down. You can see the original stump they're still working on. They're gonna bring this down in the rest of the morning. It does have some uh, cavities in here. And the farther we get down, the more and more we expect to see. Now cavities or tree hollows are actually really beneficial out in nature because they create great habitat for wildlife, uh, insects and all that. And as the tree decomposes um, naturally, like you'll drop limbs here and there and that provides also habitat and re regenerates um, nutrients into the soil which is really important but when we're in our backyards and especially when we're right against the house when these trees start to um kind of like fall towards <laughs> you know start getting older if they fall and fall in the house like that's you know it costs a lot of money and there's also liability so uh it's really sad to take this out but i'm gonna try to make the best with it i'm thinking i want to make a table out of this piece right here uh it's about four and a half feet wide with this cavity right here i'll probably hollow it out a little bit and maybe put a planter in there maybe fill this with epoxy or leave it open um it's about three i'm gonna guess it's like two and a half three feet thick or so to have a solid piece is really incredible now this is shinus mole also called the peruvian pepper i'm not sure how it works so if um how how it fares in terms of like a construction lumber. So if anybody has experience, let me know in the comments below. I'd be super curious if anybody has experience with that. I know that you can burn um, California peppers. Uh, it does irritate some people because they're part of the Anacardiaceae family, which does have some toxic um, characteristics. Uh, they do make a smoky fire. I know that people commonly use them. I grew up using pepper wood for firewood and it does create a little bit more of a smoky fire, but it's still fine. Um, but for these pieces, this is too glorious of a chunk to burn up. So uh, I'm thinking about a table. If anybody has a better idea, let me know. The last thing we did was to grind up the stump to make sure that it was low enough for the next project. And then we took all the lower branches and threw them in a chipper. And that way we had fresh mulch that we can use for the garden areas. So what do you guys think? Am I going to hell for taking this tree out or did I just save a house? I'm not sure either. <laughs> let me know in the comments below. And oh yeah, if you like my content, please subscribe. Thanks guys.